Hey guys, this is a review of Unit 6. We're going to start with our first construction, copying a given segment. You're going to take your compass, make sure that you open it to the full width of the segment, and you're going to strike an arc to show that, ooh, to show that you measured this. There we go. And then you're going to take your straight edge and construct a segment, actually a ray, of length greater than that segment. I'll call the new endpoint A prime. I guess we can put a little arrowhead on the end of that. Now with your compass at the exact same measure, putting your compass point on the new point, A prime, the end of your ray, you're going to strike an arc on that ray. And where that arc intersects the ray, we're going to place our new endpoint. We'll call that B prime. And that segment, A prime, B prime, is congruent to the given one. Now the reason for that is that the radius or the radii of two congruent circles are congruent. Now for the sake of drawing this, if you want to, you could draw a circle that goes all the way around point A where A is the center. We won't complete the whole thing, but you can see the circle there. Uh, same thing for A prime, B prime. If we start to create a circle where A prime is the center, those two circles will be congruent. They'll have exactly the same measures. And AB is the radius of the first circle. A prime, B prime is the radius of the second circle. So radii, radii of congruent circles are congruent is the justification for this construction. Have a good one.